Hey everybody, Gormac here, and I'm fiddling with my headphones. Come on, volume up. There we go. So, I'm a bit late getting this started. I accidentally slept in, but nothing really to do with uh, for that. Isn't there something there? Like right, right there? Maybe it was some item. <gasps> Portable door! Go! It doesn't work. <laughs> oh, it's never going to work, but whatever. This isn't going to work either. Oh! Well, that works. Weird that... The door doesn't, then. Whatever. You crazy, game. You crazy. Hello? Another sliver, hey? Well, you don't want to go into Zovac War without your leader wearing one of these. A helm on his head. Those mind flayers don't see much difference between slave eyes and slaves. If you aren't protected, they'll turn on you as soon as you speak to them. A free gem from one slaver to another. Where can I get one of those? What's wrong with you, Yorak? We've got the numbers advantage here. Let's pick up some more stock. He makes a good point. There are numbers. And I bet you fit a nice price at an slave auction. Uh... Dude, have you seen this guy behind me? Are you sure about what you're about to do? If you attack me, you're all dead. We'll take that chance! Attack! Okay. Feel the pain! Sick him! <laughs> Told him. I warned him! The waterfall in front of you seems quite unusual. Well, that's good to know. Give me that. Give me that. And he wasn't kidding about this helmet. Sorry I'm new to mind spells, but I need this. It's very important. Mental protects from against telepathy. Yeah? I think tentacle heads be able to read Deacon's thoughts, too. I think your thoughts are a bit beyond their comprehension, Deacon. <laughs> yep, Deacon's thoughts are beyond anybody's comprehension. So, since I'm the party leader, I only I need to wear a helmet. Helmet of shielding, thank you, game. And now we are wandering into Illithid. And right now it's populated by vacant looking grouse, witless snurfurbins, expressionless duragars, and that's mostly it. Oh, look, an Umber Hulk. Oh! Tentacle face! Which nervous agitation as you approach it speaks you in a voice you hear only in your head. These are the caverns of Zorvakmur. What business do you have here? Come to purchase thralls from your auctions. Sure. as far as thralls, but you would not be the first. Your sure thoughts are hidden to me. You will have to remove your helm before I let you in. I'm here to buy thralls, not become one. The helm stays on. It seems like it's laughing. Don't blame me for trying. Very well, you may keep the helm that protects your mind. The elbow brain is aware of your presence and knows your thoughts, even if they are strangely muted to me. A 
laugh at me, will you? Well, down we go, I guess. And elective hours. I'm not surprised to see you guys here. Rotten little. Okay, you just went up three notches on the creepy meter here. Accord, Thrall, Umber Hulk. Merchant's Compound. Arter. Like other Thlid here, this... Mind Flare makes no effort to probe your mind as you approach. You don't know if this is a good or bad sign. Welcome, unlike my fellow possessors, I am willing to do business with those of the fall races. Simple merchant like the others will come here to the market, but unlike them, I am willing to trade with you. All right, let's see what you got. Hey, Nasher's gloves. Nasher's ring, Nasher's gloves. I've only got two of the four bits, though. This is unacceptable. I'm gonna have to figure out where those other two things are. Club five, club four, club three. I do not think there's anything too special in this. In his store, except Unless you want to count uh, unlimited supply of heal potions, because that's pretty special. Let's get uh, ten more. Five for Deacon and five for Valen. I should also probably get ten or 20 heal critical wounds potions. So that uh, Deacon and Valen will have something to use other than heal potions when they heal themselves. Because I don't want those heal potions wasted. They're for emergencies. Okay. Bag of holding? No. Cloak of fortification, protection, nymph cloak plus six. Split this by one, two, three, four, five. Put that in there. Put these in there. Deacon hasn't been getting hurt much, but Valen could sure use these. Here, have a potion of aid while you're at it. Merchant. I will not sell my wares to one of humankind. Your race are fit to be thralls, nothing more. Yeah. Portal to the Grand Hall, slave auction, slave pins, fighting pits, illithid chambers. You know, if you come down here without a helmet on, you can survive, but it's not easy. That be some kind of fighting place? Who they get to fight in there? Deacon wonders. I don't know, Deacon. Let's just save. 
here so I could reload that and see what happens. Welcome to the fighting pits. Can you place a wager on the next fight. Uh <laughs> can I join the fighting pits? Uh That seems like a terrible idea. Can, can Valen join the fighting pits? Can, can he? Because he'd be pretty good at it. He'd probably be offended if I said that, though. Uh, I'll be going now. Don't need to go to the Grand Hall. So... Eh. Not that we see one of your kind here. So, uh, okay, next bid on the human female. Quite remarkable forcer species. Good, healthy stock, competent warrior. Not ready to bid yet. Hello. Huh. Tell me about this thrall. Let's start the bidding. Sure. I think I remember this. You can set her free. Stay silent. 1,300. 1,500. 2,000. Uh, 3,000? There you go. That's hardly anything. Hey. Hey. Hello. Whatever spell was keeping this woman's mind enthralled is now broken. If Illith would consider her to be your problem, she glares at you defiantly. Mew, what do you plan to do with me? Send me to send me to the pits to fight for your amusement? You disgust me. I was going to give you your freedom. All the mind players will read her thoughts and kill her. If you want to help her, you'll have to make her think she's a thrall. She's a... Yes, if you disobey me, you'll suffer a horrible, painful death. Message and the directions to get there. Give her a fake message and directions to find the seer. Go! Go, you pathetic slave! There we go. i had done a good thing by buying a slave. Let's see what's down here. say. It's okay, you can tell me. No, 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 D can be fine. Just continue your adventure, boss. No, come on, tell me. Go to bathroom. Can we stop for a moment? Uh, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> the warden. Yeah! What do you mean? Since the pits of repairs have to modify them. Thrall's minds are torn down and their very identity is stripped away until they become something... All that remains is a primitive animal. Makes for more interesting combat in the pits. Uh, 
I'm gonna go now. Into like ra oh. And I like Ravager. That's that's kind of spooky. Pretty spooky in general. I don't like these guys very much. Need to try to find the Elder Brain, according to the stream, able to convince it to withdraw Illithid support from the Valshurus. Well... Seems like the Grand Hall is where it would be. I must speak to the Elder Brain. Come to speak about the Valshurus. says you are given access to the Elder Concord but cannot enter while you wear the helm that shields your thoughts. I'm not removing my helm. You, then you will not be allowed to enter the Elder Concord. Fine, here's my freaking hat. I'm gonna die now. Don't talk to anything else. Minotaur Thrall. talk to anything else or your brain is going to melt it might just melt anyway whoa that is a literal brain with that's a big brain explores your mind seeking a better way to communicate a way to focus its multitude of consciousnesses to deal with a single entity And access to inner sanctum, a rare privilege for a thrall. You can see many of your thoughts, thrall. We know that you are an enemy of the Velshurus. You, you know the Illithid are her allies. Is that why you've come to see the Obermind of Zarakmer? So I want you to withdraw your support of the Velshurus. Many of the Ober Ithalid pods have pledged allegiance to the Velshurus. There's one Elder Concord only. A consensus of all the Elder Minds is linked to the Elder Concord can end our alliance. Can I convince that? Uh -huh. power to oppose her, we could withdraw our support. How do I do that? <gasps> you mean the really cursed mirror? That if you use it to spy on people... artifact hmm it's about sure so by making us stronger we can oppose her will this will make her weaker you have a few options. If you wish to stop the elephant from the joining of Alshras, you will bring the mirror to we of the Zarvakmer over mind. Hmm. Oh, this is one way of going about this. I think.
it's been broken and put together many times. This is my only way of casting a thrill visage on myself. And feeble mind, and see invisibility, true seeing, Claudians and clairvoyance. Let's just see what happens here. Well, that's kind of boring. Took 20 minutes, but it's kind of boring. I'm going to end it here. When I come back, we'll try doing this the other way. The way where I don't lose the Mirror of All Seeing, and there's probably a lot more violence. Because in general, I don't like the idea of making the Illithid any stronger than they are anyway. They're not the most pleasant of races. So... I guess we'll just find out how this goes. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys in a little bit, okay? Sorry for, you know, replaying it, but, you know, I want to see what happens. Yeah, I gotta see. See you guys in a bit.